Willie Robertson of Duck Dynasty spoke at the Republican convention last night. Uh, and naturally, he hit every single stale right-wing talking point under the sun. So I'm going to play for you my favorite one here. Let's watch. I have a theory about how they missed the Trump train. They don't hang out with regular folks like us who like to hunt and fish and pray and actually work for a living. What does that mean? What does that mean? And why does nobody press people like him on this? I mean, th I mean, if you're in the media and you're given, you know, talking to him afterwards, having some sort of an interview, you got to bring that up. Like, hey, hold on now. You just said that it, people support Trump and they like Trump because oh, we're normal people who like to fish hunt. But hey, we also actually work for a living. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Fucking lazy bitch ass Democrats, moochers, parasites. Why don't black people get a job? Ooh, did I say that out loud? Did I say that out loud? There's a tinge of that in there, but I, he's probably not just referring to black people. He's talking about probably just Democrats across the board and maybe even some other Republicans who didn't support Trump. But like when you say shit like that, you sound like a stupid person because that's obviously not true. That's just beyond preposterous. Like, think about what you said. Uh, I mean, that's why we like Trump. We actually work for a living. So what? I mean, you do know, you know facts exist. So you can go look at what the, the, the unemployment rate is, for example, in majority Democratic states. And it's hovering about what it is in the, for, for the entire nation. So you 5%. It's not like in their mind, they think you have the good people in the country, Republicans... Uh, and they bust their ass, and they do all the work, and they pay all the taxes, and then the Democratic half of the country, this is like Mitt Romney's 47% comment, the Democratic half of the country, they're never going to get their shit together, they're never going to get a job, none of them have a job, they're all on unemployment, they're all on welfare, and it's the good Republicans who pay for the shitty Democrats, and the Democrats sit on their ass all day long, and just collect their check, and they don't actually work for a living. That's the 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 caricature of America that he has in his head, and it is all based on stereotypes. None of that is fact. In fact, I remember we covered the story when Mitt Romney said it, and there were a bunch of articles that came out with all the statistics from all across the country. Do you know who, who are the net biggest recipients of federal tax money? Red states. I mean, think about that. They bash Democrats as like lazy moochers. Democratic states are net federal tax payers. So we give more than we take in democratic states. The red states are net tax receivers. In other words, if you buy into the whole paradigm of oh, welfare queens, the biggest welfare queens are the red states. And then, by the way, that's not even a fucking fair paradigm because when you look at the people who really are net receivers of tax money, who is it? Veterans, senior citizens, uh, you know, mentally uh, disabled people or just disabled people. People who work full-time jobs, but don't make enough money to support themselves because the minimum wage is so low, for example. And by the way, again, those are, in their mind, like, oh, they're just Democrats, not just Democrats. More Republicans. So this just, you're a shitty person if you say that. <laughs> I mean, I'm trying to find a nice way to say it, but I can't. Like, these are the same people who claim to love Jesus. Would Jesus say some shit like that? Like... Uh, you know, all right, only the good people. Where are the good people? Trump people. We actually like to work for a living. Other motherfuckers are lazy, you know what I'm saying? Jesus wouldn't... I mean, he's the one who said, basically, I I'm anti-rich. If you read the Bible, there are stories that are just flat-out anti-rich. Read the story of Lazarus. You can't even get into heaven if you're rich. It, 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 that's for the poor to inherit. And then, finally, dude, you do a reality show about fucking duck kazoos. Spare me with your, uh, I work so hard. <laughs> You're on TV, dipshit, and it's a reality show. It's fucking, uh, I work so hard, I, I er, deserve this, however fucking many millions of dollars he makes for being a hillbilly in the middle of nowhere, uh, you know, and his family's goofy, so ha <laughs> ha, here's money. Look, I'm not, I'm not getting down on them for the show, and they should make a lot of money if in the marketplace it does well, and it does do well. But what I, I hate is the smug attitude, and this is something you always find on the right. 
on the right, they always think they're the only people that work hard. Like, they don't, they're incapable of doing the, the mental exercise of like, okay, this is how this person lives. Like, let me see, what would it be like if I was in this person's shoes? They never do that. They just assume like, I work today and wow, what the fuck did you do? You're not working right now, so therefore I guess you didn't work. Fucking stop and think, you asshole. Stop and think. Like I said, the unemployment rate in the country right now is what, like 5%? And you're fucking berating Democrats? Ah, oh, they don't work. People don't vote Trump. They don't actually work. What a fucking prick this guy is, man. I can't... <laughs> I'm a little worked up if you can't tell, but I... You know what it is? They embrace their ignorance. They don't care to learn about what's actually happening. Like I said, I just gave you the facts. I just told you... You know, the red states are recipients of federal tax money. Blue states are net payers. I told you who actually are the people that don't pay taxes. And by the way, the people who don't pay federal taxes because they don't make enough money to, it's not like they don't pay any tax. They pay state tax. They pay local tax. They pay sales tax. They pay, they're, they're taxed in all different kinds of ways. But what they want to do is they want to blame poor people for being poor as if there's no such thing as systemic factors that go into it, which is just closed-minded and, and ridiculous. So, I'm done with clowns like this, but this shows you the, the state of the modern-day Republican Party. Like, they thought, oh, I know who will get to fucking talk here. The duck asshole. <laughs> get the guy from the duck show to come here and berate everybody in the country like they don't work unless they vote for Trump. Please, fucking spare me.